So Discussions is the show that we're hosting right now and that you're watching. And thank you so much for that. And Dan, thank you so much. Thank you for hosting this with me because if not, it would just be me sitting in my room alone. Somehow sadder. Soda. I mean, this is already very sad. Yeah, because we're almost 40 and we're yeah. like, let's drink soda together in our in our cuz friend's bedroom. <laughs> it's not a bedroom. It's a video game room. Jim, oh, yeah. take a quick tour, please. Take a lap. There's Keith. Woo! Shout out to Keith. What's up, Keith? Yeah, Keith! <laughs> oh, shit. Dan, starry. Starry, starry, starry night. night. Uh, that song's about Vincent Van Gogh, guys. This is uh, a new rebranding from PepsiCo yep. of Sierra Mist. Dan got the last bottle on Earth of Sierra Mist. <laughs> Pretty this, much. This is worth a lot of money because people love Sierra Mist. Dan, what is, what's your history with Sierra Mist? Don't care. <laughs> I, I mean, I've probably had Sierra Mist, but I'm not a huge... When it comes to, like, the big soda companies, I'm not a big, like, lemon-lime soda guy. Yeah. Um, so I would never, like, seek it out. Yeah, I usually just get, like, Sprite or 7-Up. Sierra Mist is, like... I don't even remember seeing it in stores for years. But I remember being in fountains a lot. My first... One of my first jobs, I worked at an amusement park. Yeah. Lake Compounds. Yep. And they had Pepsi products, and it was free for everybody. Free mm -hmm. for employees. Free for guests, and it was very hot out. And they were giving everybody free sugar to dehydrate you <laughs> when you're out there for like eight hours a day. And Sierra Mist was like brand new on the scene, mm -hmm. so I drank a lot of it. I was like, "Whoa, Sierra Mist! What's this new Sprite thing?" Like, did you have a wallet chain at the time? I, at one, I point, feel like people yeah. who are drinking a lot of Sierra Mist have wallet chains. <laughs> Still, or in 2002? Well, that's why they're not making Sierra Mist anymore because oh, the right. wallet chain kids grew up and are like. I only drink IPAs and <laughs> seltzer. Okay. Uh, so Pepsi rebranded it. Dan mm -hmm. mentioned before we started recording that the bottle's green. Yeah. This bottle's clear mm -hmm. because they're they're getting rid of... See, they're like, we want to be more green. They want to be And get rid of the green. Mm -hmm. And we don't want all these extra chemicals in the bottles or whatever they want to do. I just think because of supply chain, they couldn't get their green bottle. So they're like, we're using whatever the fuck we got. Let's and also go cheap. back a little bit and say that Pepsi has had a history of not being able to get their shit together with a lemon lime soda. Yeah. They the, can't. They can't compete. I saw a TikTok that showed that they've had like 10 different versions of this in the past like 30 years. Twist Mist. They tried to rebrand Sierra Mist a couple times. Yeah. Um, extreme. We're extreme seven up. But they're going all out with this in, in the marketing. I've seen this everywhere so far. I haven't tried this What do you yet. think of the marketing? Like the label, the font, the design? I like it. I think it's, it's... I think it's shit. I think it's dog shit. Really? Yeah. Compared to this. I mean, this isn't great, but this is like trying to go... This harkens back to a fictional retro brand. Yeah. It's, it yeah, feels like exactly. they're trying to trick us into like... We were starry. And then this, this right here, this, this just looks like a sports logo from the early 2000s. This is a shit logo. This looks like when you go on, like, um, what's the company where you can get people to, like, do projects for you? Fiverr. Fiverr. Yeah. This looks like if you go on Fiverr and you go to, like, the, the cheapest graphic designer who's, like, a 14-year-old in Vietnam. And they're, like, showing you all their team logos. There's definitely a Sierra Mist hockey team. But I like this. This is modern, but it harkens no, back not. to a simpler It's time. a lie, Jeff. It's trying to convince you that they were one starry and now they're going this back to This is starry. No, but Jeff. They were one. So they weren't, they were starry before. That's, that's what that's it feels like they're trying to convince you. Okay. What? How are you going to have a retro throwback logo of a brand that didn't exist? Why not go back to one of those old Pepsi brands? What, what, what did Pepsi have? If you're this gonna, was their first, I believe. No, that's not true. Unless it was like Slice, maybe was Slice Pepsi. I don't remember, but there's a TikTok out there. Go find it, guys. Yes, guys, find the TikTok <laughs> that shows all of them. There's not many TikToks out there. You could easily find it. This is like a 1970s throwback, and I'm not buying it. All right. So here's the deal. Here's the deal, Dan. Keith the before deal. was holding the bottles up like this, and he was reading them. He was like, "What's the difference? The difference right here, Jim." This is made with real sugar. This is high fructose corn syrup. Yep. So the product that, pro this probably tastes better. I haven't had Sierra Mist in fucking who knows how. I was honestly surprised when I bought this that it has real sugar. In yeah, it. and this has high fructose corn syrup. So I'm interested to see how similar they taste because this is, this is the same product just rebranded, but there's already one difference. Do we know, I didn't hear that it's the same product 
It's a rebrand of Sierra Mist. I thought it was like a launch of a new flavor. No, they're replacing it. That's why when you found Sierra Mist, I was like, this is Well, I know they're incredible. replacing it because they don't need two very similar sodas. But I think it's a little bit more than a rebrand. A rebrand is like a change of a name and a logo. I think there's like recipe changes in here. We're going to oh, yeah. just have to find yeah. out. Let's find, what do you want to try first? Sierra Mist. We're going to go chronological. <laughs> We're not going to Tarantino this review. Oh, that is... No, that is normal. That's what soda I does. I thought it was going to overflow. No, it wasn't I never close. opened a soda before. It's scary. Yeah, it smells like every other fucking lemon wine soda I've ever had in my life. I mean, let's be honest. Out of like flavor notes, I would say that this genre of soda is like the most difficult to determine differences. Yeah. Colas, you can really taste the difference. Root beers, uh, other. Sodas. I'm out of soda flavors. It's pretty good. It's crisp. It's citrusy. Um, it's smooth. Yeah. I don't know that I could define this in a blind taste test, though. If you like, actually, I, I, be able I to know either. that I couldn't. If you had like Seven Up, Sierra Mist, and Sprite, I think between Sprite maybe because I've had it more, but Seven Up, they've also changed their formulation a couple times. Over the years, so I don't know. This is, it's very 7-Up-y. It's got a very appealing bubble. Like the yeah. carbonation level is nice because it's not super fizzy at, up front. No, it has it has that spicy bite. That you, yeah, like that you're you getting want. carbonation all the way through. And it does have a natural sweetness. Um, let's just go for the new guy. You want to just go into it, Dan? I don't want to wait too long. I don't want to wait for my starry to get warmer. It smells the same. <laughs> what if we can't taste the difference? What if we mix them together at the end? <laughs> That's very on brand for us. All right, let's try it. It's like the least creative thing you could do, but we package it as like such a great idea. They're the same thing. It's the same It's pretty much the same. Yeah. I might get a hint more lemon on this. It's hard to tell because they're both very light, but also very crisp. So all you're getting at first is just like that really Carbonation's good carbonation. Insane. Yeah. I will admit. Oh, I just glanced. I saw it. It was vile. I will admit that normally we're like sticklers for like natural sugar versus high fructose. I don't know if I could tell. I don't either. There's a little bit of an aftertaste with this. And maybe that's the natural sugar that is lingering. But well, I think this finish is smoother too, whereas this gives me that syrup in the back of my throat feel. Somebody posted a conspiracy theory about this. They said, of course, Jeff found it. They said Pepsi's, they're going to blast this out and everybody's going to buy it up because it's new. But then people are going to miss Sierra Mist, which nobody, I don't think one person drank this in the last 15 years. Um, and then when they bring this back, it'll be more popular. I mean, I don't think that's a crazy theory. I think they no. do shit like that all the time. Yeah. Um, these are pretty much the same. Um, this is fine. If you want this instead of Sprite, whatever, it's all the same to me. This Sprite and 7-Up, I, I propose we taste all of them next to each other and Dan poo pooed it. And I was like, that's probably a better idea. We don't need to do that. Uh, it tastes the same. Oh, oh. I, I, uh, I'm having a hard time trying to discern if it's a placebo effect, but I feel like I like this one a little bit better. Let's try it out. Try what up? Try it up. Close your... Look that way, Dan. Just just talk. I'm talking. Oh, Jeff's going to give me a blind taste test. Blind taste it. test. Here we go. My face itches from sleeping. Do you guys ever sleep and wake up itchy? All right, guys. Starry, for the audience, is going into this cup. So Starry is here. And then we got... Sierra Mist is going into this cup. Don't right do here. a fake out and only pour one. That would have been really funny. I should have thought about that. Why am I a worse host than Dan? All right. I'm going to twist them around. Because all your brain cells went to your good bad looks. Okay, Dan. I know which is which. I just showed it to the audience. And if I don't know, they'll know. Okay, Dan. So one of these, you're telling the truth, is legitimate. I swear to God. One of them is legitimate. Sorry. And one of them is Sierra Mist. Mm. I want to taste this first, actually. Okay. 
Hä? Fuck, I thought I had it. <laughs> <laughs> I think they taste the same. Hold on. This is Sierra Mist. That is incorrect. Fuck! <laughs> <laughs> I thought I had it. Yeah, I mean... The Moral of the story, they're the same. They're close enough to be the same. It's fine. Um, see, the thing with soda is it's so expensive now. I don't even want to fucking buy it. This, this bottle is like two twenty five at Dollar General. Mm -hmm. And this is probably like a $1.60 or whatever. <laughs> um, so, yeah, it's fine. It's, it's whatever it is. It's a, a crisp, refreshing lemon-lime beverage. Jeff, do you know any, like, serious soda fans who actually love lemon-lime sodas? I feel like real soda fans are into either weird shit like Mountain Dew or, like, okay, so earthy, like, natural root beers. And How would you define a real soda fan? Because here we are yeah, filming, like, our 60th episode of drinking soda together. Are we real soda fans? Yeah. So how often do you drink this? Never. There's your answer. Yeah, but Jeff, that's just <laughs> circumstantial evidence. Well, I'm sure that there's some... I need a poll of the soda community. I'm sure there's some people that, like, only drink lemon-lime sodas. It's so weird to me. I don't know any adults who are like, I'm going to go with the 7-Up. Well, that's because you've never gone to McDonald's and got their Sprite. I heard that's it's, where it's spicy. Busting. Yeah. I mean, it's, it's just fucking Sprite. It's, it's a meme, guys. It's just a meme. It's not real life. Ready, Jeff? What the fuck?! Who knew we were gonna oh go there? God. Let's do. I'm doing it. Let's Anything do it. could happen on soda discussion. Wow, this is wickedy wild, wild west. Everything is legal in New Jersey. I yoink. <laughs> wow, that's you're a mixed. I didn't taste exactly the same as both of them. They kind of taste a little worse. Does it taste worse? No. No? Okay. It's fine. It's fine. We're all fine. Everything's fine. What if there was like one ingredient that they purposely like put in there to prevent us from doing this? And it was like <laughs> interrupted. That would be cool. Chemical reactions are so dope. <laughs> They're so dumb. <laughs> That's the episode, folks. Like and subscribe. Watch them all. <laughs> Keep going. Gotta catch them all. So discussions. What's your opinion on the Sierra Mist? Ever drink it? My name? That's why, like, I, uh, I, you know from SpongeBob? Where he's like, he forgets his name. Oh, yes. Yeah, that's why. That's how I feel about Sierra Mist. I don't really understand. Yeah. Like, I don't really drink it. Okay. Like, usually just Sprite is, right. is what I go to. So, Fair. um, but it's good. It's fine. fine, yeah. Like normal Sierra Mist, I was not a fan of, but I think there was one offshoot. It was like a pink color, I want to say, which was quite good. I, it might have been like a cranberry. Um, but yeah. Every once in a while, they'll be like, oh, can I? You'd be like, oh, can I have a Sprite? And, and then the waitress is like, we have Sierra Mist. And you're like, sure. Okay. Yeah. But it's the same. That's your there's not a lot of flavor for me. It just, you get a hint of the lemon, but a lot of the bite, which is good. You want that with the lemon lime soda, but a lot of bite, a lot of carbonation. Yeah, it's 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 light. I think it's, it's light. light. And I don't know, it's like an upset stomach yeah. soda for me. <laughs> I can taste the sugar. I, 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 I feel that sugar aftertaste. I'm trying to keep that taste in my mind as I yep. drink this. <laughs> really tastes like the exact same to me i kind of taste the sugar that's jimmy's no i'm not a fan of this redesign it looks like uh i don't get it i don't get the name i don't like, either no. at least sierra mist like reminds you of what it is right but, i like you know it's funny because dan was talking or somebody was talking about this being like fiber like shitty I think that looks like a fire yeah, design. Yeah, I was gonna say this is uh this is a little too literally like this it's is like lemon and lime, yeah. like this split like, in half and Yeah. Yeah. This is like the fiber like premium, like you'll pay a little yeah. bit extra for something like this. Which is not to say it's bad, but I, I'm not a huge fan of it. I'm going Sierra Mist on this. You like it better? I like, I like, like it better. 
Yes. You like the taste? I like the taste better. But I didn't taste any difference. No. Do you guys taste the difference? Let us know in the comments. <laughs> Jimmy's a better host. Are you still listening? <laughs> yeah. Are you still here? Go home.